So the episode reopened with Johnny Bananas going home, thanks to the real. Carl Maria going home, thanks to Laura. Yeah, Carl Maria, you hyped yourself up, Monty. Day. I'm good. I must say, you impressed me with this elimination round. I thought you were going to give her a run for her money. I guess I was wrong. I, I'm entitled to be wrong sometimes. Nicole, now I know you're a lesbian. I know you like girls. But must we hear you and your horny thoughts? Can you please keep them to your goddamn self? You sound like a horny virgin about ready to have her first lesbian experience with a woman. You sound desperate and thirsty. Are you not getting any? Cause it sound like the way you talk. It sound like if you were to not run, you'd be ripping her clothes off besides getting the ball away from her. Please put your sexual frustrations up and tell it to somebody who cares, Nicole. Because if I have to hear one more of you and your sexual and your horny level, I'm going to fucking scream. So after all the lesbian sexual frustration, after all the arguing, all the drinking, all the fights, all the people calling each other dumb names, after the lesbian situation didn't calm down, now we finally get to the damn challenge. About damn time, y'all could have cut all half of that shit out y'all had in there. So Nicole Ryan here chasing kitty cats, but bitch, you can't even want to do a channel that you said you good at. Find out you're not so good, your time expired, and you ain't even want to get time to complete the damn challenge. But Laura did it and finish it, and now you begging her for chaps. Nicole, stop focusing on pussy and do better than the challenge where you go home. That cat gonna get your ass in trouble and get you something home without some money. You better focus hard on what you're really here for, not for the available female that's gonna give you some. This episode didn't give too much. It wasn't that much besides a lesbian love affair, a lesbian three ring circus. Well, Nicole wanted to be a lesbian three ring circus. The underdogs won thanks to Corey, where they thought they lost. So Corey came from under the water with his um thing in the air. So they won. TJ decided it was a cash grab. This wasn't an elimination round. He basically gave them a house party, was basically leading him coming up, talking about an uh, underdog blood battle. So I guess they all fit to compete against each other, each other to see who lasts the longest or whatever. Yeah. Um, <laughs> this episode didn't really give much to me, though. And that's why this video is simple, short, and sweet. Because the episode didn't give me no life, and I wasn't impressed that really. So. Anyways, though, y'all, that was the episode. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll see y'all later. Enjoy the rest of y'all night. Bye.